good morning today we are going to discuss about the topic scales are levels of measurement in the unit 1 fundamentals of gis scales levels of measurement the course outcome of this topic is explain the fundamental concept of gis this will be integrated with the po1 po5 and the pso1 the outcome of this topic is the clear explanation about the fundamental concept of gis scales of measurement attributes measurement scales for spatial data including map scale expressed as a representative fraction coordinates grids and map projection like a ratio interval ordinal or rank category nominal or category cycle counts and amount in a ratio based the values from the ratio measurement systems are derived relative to a fixed zero points on a linear scale mathematical operations can be used on these values with predictable predictable and meaningful result examples of ratio measurement are age distance weight and value so see from 0 to 14 the kilometer and then distance scale this is the ratio we have mentioned like a scale second one is the interval time of day calendar year the feather rent temperature scale and the ph values are all examples of interval measurement so see the ph scale from 0 to 14 so below the 6.5 are 7.5 8.5 sorry below the 6.5 is the acidic more than 8.5 is a basic level so it is under the neutral level from 6.5 to 8.5 so below that acidic and more than like an salinity form then ordinal or the rank level so see the ordinal values determine position this measurement show place such as first second and third but they do not establish the magnitude or relative propositions knowing the winners only by place user do not know how much faster the first place runner was compared with the second place runner the nominal or category based values associated with this measurement system are used to identify one instant from another they may also establish the group class member or category with which the object is associated these values are qualities not quantities with no relation to a fixed point or a linear scale so other nominal values are social security scrutiny number so the numbers called in the category based then directional and cyclic based in gis it is sometimes necessary to deal with the data that can be directional or cyclic including flow direction on a map or a compass direction or longitude so see the example in earth rotation numbers follows 359 is zero in week saturday follow sundays so count and amounts so counts and amounts shows total numbers a count is the actual number of features on the map and amount can be any measurable quantity associated with feature so the example is district wise population in map so the assessment part of the session is 3d lines or polylines features embedded there dash inside this geometry so kindly understand clearly about the concept and attend the assessment these are the reference material thank you